Miles Morales, A Leap of Faith. So I was looking this up and I was trying to find the best image to draw. I saw ones that were like flying through the air and all that kind of stuff, but it would have been hard to sort of fit in. But this is the one just before he jumps off the side of that glass or the skyscraper, right? So I'm going to just draw a line down here just to get the sort of skyscraper in first. You could do this as far in as you want, but I'm just going to put it. And his hands and his feet and stuff would come off this, but we'll just draw it sort of this way, right? His hands and feet will kind of go over this. You know, that he's like standing on the glass, but this is the like the very edge of the building that we can see. Okay. This is just all glass here, right? So because this is like sort of a full body thing, right? I'm gonna just do his just to get everything sort of the right scale, I'm gonna do his hand here because his wrist kind of comes right across. I'm gonna start with his arm that goes this way. Okay, and then his his jacket and stuff and his hood, right? Because I want to make sure I'm in scale on the building. It's kind of a bit more complicated drawing figures like this, but we'll do our best, right? So his sleeve, right, so of his wrist is just here. Look at his jacket, right? And this kind of like bumps this way. And this will go all the way up down to here. And this is like his shoulder. And it'll go like that. And there's all these sort of faux lines and things on them. So then the collar of his green jacket, right, is just up here. That's his shoulder. So it's just a little bit more up this way. And the back of it kind of goes down there. Across to here. Towards there, right? And then so his chest and stuff will just come across. Down this way, right? And then his back will come out from here. So again, I'm just doing this so we can get everything sort of in scale. Right? So this is his back. stuff on this just back here and then you can see some of his red hoodie just there right So, so his hood is up at the top here, right? So it just goes, kind of bumps out here, around. And we can see a little bit of his, his face sticking out. So it goes down. And like so. into there somewhere and then again we'll have some like folding lines like so right and then so his his face kind of sticks out from here so we go to a diagonal out and then we meet his nose curves back in 
down at his chin, then goes around into here. And then we can just see that red eye and the inside of that. Just there. And then some webbing. So webbing that comes down. Very thin line. There, and another one just come around here. And then the webbing that comes across. And the other side of his hood goes down there. And a little bit comes out from his chin here as well. Like so. Right, and then so so he's got a big leg, so it comes from here, so we go. And then his knee sort of bends around. Goes down back in towards his foot in here. Okay, so he's about to launch himself off. cords of his hoodie as well, right? So like this hanging down here, You've got like a knot or something. Hanging down there and another one just coming across his knee. So this one will go all the way up into here. So, right, and then that sort of square thing that hangs off there. Okay, so general shape, kind of like that. So this is his leg, right? So we can see his, his waistband and his rear end back here. Right, and there's like a belt or something sticking off sort of here. pocket of his jeans and then the way the jeans sort of fold you know on his calf and his calf goes out and down there okay and then there's like so one side of his leg and then we got his sneakers and his hand and all that kind of stuff. But we'll do, we'll get the other leg in before we do any sneakers and stuff. So the other leg comes out from behind here. And we got another sort of jean sort of area. There, and his calf down that way. <clears throat> and his other hand comes out from behind here. It's sitting on the glass as well. Okay, so hands and feet always tricky, right? So we'll do we'll do this these hands first. We'll start here. So we'll go <clears throat> down like so, out to his finger, down there. Curves around, 
then the next finger, same sort of shape, down, or flat against the glass. So it goes around like that. Like that, and then his little finger. Yeah, his hand is just like flat against the glass here. It's just these kind of lines. And then he's got, you know, red sort of tops on his gloves. Red fingers is kind of like spray painted, but we'll go. So we'll just go across here. So let that be red and then an edge line on the glove and the spider web kind of just goes around webbing lines like so and then up the glove here more webbing lines So, and of course, the line for the building you'd have to erase. So, if you, I recommend doing this with pencil, obviously. And then maybe we can see just a little bit more of his hand on that side, right? So, in the other hand above, so we can we're looking at kind of the back of it, right? So, the thumb sort of comes down this way and around. So and it goes down and you can just see the, the palm of his hand sort of bumping along here and his little finger goes off that way and back in. And then some webbing lines coming down the inside of it. sort of a shadow maybe line just to show it's touching the glass okay so his feet now his sneakers right so we got say like the top of it there and then it goes down behind the hand like that and then the front goes down this way Like so, and then underneath the hand here. All right, so that's the general shape for that foot. And then the other one, coming across, down, just goes off my page, you more room. Feel free to fit the rest of that foot in. So just like maybe a bit of a shadow just underneath it here. Like so, and then the rest of his sort of trousers there. He's got a bit of a pocket here. Stitching on it. And then more details. So we got some webbing on his leg. seam going up the side of his leg there and then webbing running down towards his shoes
Just adding a bit of a shadow on the hand here. Okay, and then the cross webbing on this. Right, and then sort of the simple, so the Nike sort of tick. Nice ad placement there. And then we got like some shapes just to just run down like this. All right, and then so the line, so the tongue sort of here, and then the lace area, and then down this way. goes across there and then another sort of black area there and then the lace is sort of crisscrossed this way so we'll just go we we'll keep it simple we'll just go across another section there Kind of like that, and then same thing down here, the Nike symbol. And then break it up so we got like the there's like a red sole. And white here as well. Break it down. Like so the tongue and then like some laces tied is coming across do 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 think another sort of section there and this one like comes across right here Bring these further. Okay. So, and then you can like thicken up some of your edge lines. Right. So, and then anything else you want to add, like some lines, maybe some vertical lines just on this, just to show maybe a bit of glass sort of a thing that it's a surface you know that we get it's not just empty air adding some lines like this sometimes can help um then did i put something here oh, it's hard to know maybe just some like debris or something just
Right, but I think I'll leave it there. That's how to draw Miles Morales, a leap of faith. Hope it was helpful, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.